What's up guys, this is Rintin and I'm just going to be bringing you my first ever Modern Warfare 3 Xbox Live game. I uh, decided to buy on the Xbox as all my friends have it on the Xbox. Um, I've said pretty much I do have the Xbox but the only reason I have it is just to party chat with my friends because they all play on the Xbox. So I thought I'd just buy it on here and um, have a couple of games and all just play with them every now and then. So I just thought i uh, just bring you the uh, first ever game on the Xbox, thought it would be an interesting video to watch, just uh, um, it's no amazing game, just say that, but it's just my, my first um, Modern Warfare 3 game on the Xbox, uh, two level up to level 4 I think it is within this first game, it's pretty awesome to be honest, um, I've been told it plays better, to be honest it does not play any different whatsoever plays exactly the same as how it feels on the uh, PlayStation to me to be honest the only difference that I've noticed is guns sound more beefier and that's it really the gun there's the gun sounds have changed from the PlayStation and the Xbox well that's no big deal it doesn't change how the game plays at all to me in my opinion it just changes the sound um, just thought I'd play kill confirmed just a current game mode I've been playing on the PlayStation so I thought I'd give a go on the Xbox kill confirmed. Uh, always when I prestige or I'm level one, I always just go for this G36E um, with the assault standard class because it's a great gun for me to use. <laughs> always, you see me mess around with my these things for a while. Um, I do run tactical controls on PlayStation and the Xbox. Just needed to change it there. Uh, I just like don't do amazing off the start. I go see it. I just find it's a bit too fast. Just haven't played the Xbox for a while, so change up. Um, get the one kill, get me reload in, and there's a guy down there behind them uh, barrels. Uh, start off quite well, get the two kills, and uh, boom! That guy in the doorway, <laughs> did not see him, did not expect anyone to be there. Changing all my brightness and stuff, forgot about it all, so I'm like, changing all up, doing my margins, getting them in the right place, and all that, you know, making sure it's correct, and then boom, and I'm off. Um, don't get no insane kill streak or what's it good? Any good uh, kill feeds and things like that. Mine went a bit blank. I'm just uh, running around, just playing it up and uh, trying to get used to the controller. To be honest, um, not the best thing to get used to. And one other thing that I found is that um, it's hard. I find the analogs aren't. They're not as smooth as the PlayStation ones, and they're a lot stiffer. Um, I find it harder to aim more precise than someone behind a wall, head glitching, and all that, whatever you call it. Um, I'm gonna give it a couple of goes, you know, just uh, play for a while, see what's like. But to be honest, I'm always gonna be a PlayStation player. I think. Um, always been a PlayStation player. Uh, I did ever get the first ever Xbox. Didn't really like it, and I don't really like the Xbox 360. It's good, but I just feel it's yeah, just the, the controllers and not a big fan of them to be honest. And the analogs is another big thing. I know you can probably say I can go buy an expensive one and it'll be smoother, but I'm not into. Don't fancy spending loads of money on a controller when I probably don't play it that much. I probably won't play it that much. Um, but I don't know yet. Um, quite enjoying it. I've been playing a couple of games. This is I tried doing a live one, but my audio didn't work. So I'm pretty glad about that. But this is a uh, been playing for a while. I'm just currently level 16. Um, not played many games. Just been playing Kill Confirmed and just a uh, scary domination. Uh, you've probably seen all my other videos, and I do play domination all the time. But I thought I needed a change, so I started playing Kill Confirmed on the PlayStation, and I quite enjoyed it. It's quite fun. The spawns are quite close and annoying sometimes, but it's good fun. And with the like on that I tried recording for this game that I failed, so I forgot to record the audio, so it's pretty shit. Um, lucky I didn't, because I did swear a couple of times. Don't really like swearing in my videos, it just feels like it ruins them. But oh, every now and then you'll probably, I probably have put a couple of words here and there. Um, I just don't want to put any in there, just, it's just pointless to be well, you shouldn't have to swear throughout your videos, just hear one here and there is good. But I've seen some videos and that's all it is, it's constant swearing on YouTube. It's like, 
How can you watch it? It's just, it just gets annoying, to be honest. Um, holding it, camping it, whatever you want to call it. Spraying pay here, spraying prey, and I get the friggin' assist. Almost went there, didn't I? That was a close one. Just confirm the kill, give him a points. Points? Oh, pop this guy. Pop him, pop him. Oh man, I lose the battle. Just gonna get a drink. Two seconds. And I'm back. Pretty uh, guy, and I didn't get them kills. I was shooting into it quite a bit more. I enabled something. What was that? I swear it was disabled originally. I'll have a little look. A little vibration, that's what I want. I want it on or off. I'll leave it off. I haven't played without a vibrating controller, so let's see if there's any different. We lie down and spring the PP9 and one That's PP90 M1. Yeah, I think I can find this guy. Cannot get him, and I get shot in the back by them. Oh, the most annoying things ever. The FM G9 Akimbo. Absolutely hate them. I hate coming up against them. I hate people that use them. As a primary weapon, because it's pointless to be honest. But, yeah, fair enough, they're close called maps and stuff, but use them as a primary weapon are just pointless because. Oh, just knock my mic, sorry about that, guys. They just get annoying and. Oh, I just get fed up with them and have people that use them. I'm doing amazing, doing okay though, still holding out a 2kd. Uh, I do hold out a 2kd throughout the whole game, so that's a good one, it's a good start, I guess. Um. My current KD, little tips, is just 2.0 on the Xbox, 2.59 or 6, yeah, 2.57 or 5.9 on the PlayStation. Obviously, I've just been playing the PlayStation a lot longer, so it, it's always going to be higher. I've always been better on the PlayStation, to be honest. But you never know, I might start to play a bit. I'm probably going to play this a bit more. I'm um, going to bring some, probably bring some Xbox videos here and there. The only thing is I gotta keep swapping the cable on my whole pod because I play on my PlayStation more often and I don't call as much. Even though I could play HDMI and just if I get a good game, stick it in my theater. But I feel I just sometimes I just feel like recording randomly, so if I hook it up to the whole pod and I play it, it'd just be a lot cooler. Always do that mistake where I throw the grenade and not actually in the care package. Always done that on uh, Modern Warfare 2, always. I used to kill myself doing that one. I used to think, oh yeah, I throw it down. And then, oh, too close to the grenade, and boom. So I just throw it down, look away, get a drink or whatnot, and I find out I'm dead. This is a bonus of a uh, care package. Get the Osprey Gunner, get me a few kills. I'm not a big fan of these, to be honest, but they're fun to use if you get them in a care package or you uh, steal them from the enemy. Um, most thing I always try doing is think, oh yeah, this could be a real Osprey Gunner, and then you know, it's so like one of them really trap care package. But often I don't go for them no more to try to risk it. Sometimes I think, if it's a credit missile, I'll, I always try it, but sometimes I still get blown up by a trap one. It's quite annoying. It's quite a cool feature of the game, to be honest, because I've seen so many people like get crippled from uh, putting out one, and there's three people trying to get it, and boom! We go down. We'll all just die up. Just uh, peek at my care packages, see what I get. And come up to the end of the game now, guys. I'm gonna play Pen the Xbox for a while. If I get any good games, I'll uh, post them up on YouTube and I'm um, gonna leave you to it. And this is Rinkin. Peace out. Hope you're enjoying my content before I go. Um, just, just a quick one, just saying, I hope you enjoy the content I bring in. And the Road to Commandos on the PlayStation and my uh, MOABs that I keep bringing up. I uh, might go for a couple on the Xbox and see what it's like. Um, this time, I'm actually gonna go. Uh, this is Renting guys, if you don't know, uh, thanks for watching, enjoy it, peace out. Just another day, good job.